Oh, the hardest thing I'll ever have to do Is holding her Loving you What's going on, gang? Matt here, country song teacher at Acoustic Selection. Matt McCoy, One Man, Three Channels. Yeah, I've said before this channel, we do mostly prime country. So thank you all for stopping by. If you love prime country, smash the like button. Subscribe if you haven't. You know how we roll. This is going to be a fun little song to play. It's going to use four chords. G, C, D, and an A minor. I'll show you a little more detail of those. But it's a fun song. Earl Thomas Conley has probably one of the best voices to me ever to be in country music. If you think of prime country, he's definitely up there with Keith Whitley and uh, Paul Overstreet, Doug Stone, Joe Diffie, uh, Diamond Rio, Alabama, Blackhawk, Lone Star. So let's begin here. So it's going to be the same thing, kind of all the verses. Kind of, there's a little pre chorus. Let's start with the regular G chord, two bottom strings, fifth and sixth. Let's start all six. Oh, the third hardest thing I'll ever do is didn't even here without you. So I'm doing a two count. One, two, C. So for a C, all you do, it's a C at nine, just move your top two fingers down to the fourth and fifth. So the, the G to C transition is super easy if you're new to my lessons. So it's the third hardest thing I'll ever do. D. So a D, just press the third string. Keep the bottom two locked. That stabilizes guitar, makes it very easy and smooth for your chord changes. Leaving here without you. And the second hardest thing I'll ever do is telling her D about you. And then you go to your last chord of A minor which is the second string, <coughs> excuse me, second string, then fourth and third. So your second string, fourth and third, and strum the bottom five. She's been good to me, G, when things were going good. So you did a four count for A minor and G. How can I tell her now, G, good ain't good enough, well, the hardest thing I've ever play through that whole thing because like I said the second verse all of that is the same really if you struggle with I say this often but it's worth repeating if you struggle with strumming don't focus so much on the down ups and all that stuff keep it very simple and basic just to listen for the timing every now and then I'll do an up strum but notice how I just do those simple down strums so remember it's a G C D and an A minor so here we go it's the third hardest thing I've ever done Second verse is all that, um, all the same. But what a jam, man. Love that well-written song. Um, gotta love that 80s and 90s country for sure. Guys, check out my website. If you haven't already, Country Song Teacher, a bunch of y'all already purchased my DVDs. Super discounted right now. DVDs, my four-chord songbook. That's 40 songs, and the, and the chord locations are in the right spot. They're perfectly, it's in a PDF format, so it's perfectly organized. Um, with just G, C, E minor, and D. All 40 songs, just use those four chords. 
If you don't know how to play one of the songs by Luke Combs, Luke Bryan, whoever, you can click on the title and it links to the video show and how to play that. So go check it out. It's just eight bucks on my website. Go So go to countrysongteacher.com. After you smash the like button and subscribe, let me know in the comment section below what song I'm going to teach next. I'm going to go over for my country song teacher channel now and teach red letter, red words, wait, red neck, red letters, red dirt, Morgan Wallen. So head over there and check it out. Holla.